Hey, what's up, guys? It's Art here. All right, um, I'm actually gonna be working on my Land Rover, my white truck. Um, sure, yeah, no I'm basically gonna be doing the trans uh, service on this thing. Now, I haven't done it since uh, I bought this vehicle. I bought it as a lemon. Motor didn't work, right? We all know that. And uh, replaced the engine, but I haven't serviced the uh, the transmission. So I'm actually uh, gonna show you in different parts um, as you know the process that I'm gonna take because I did try to take one of the bolts out and it seemed like I was stretching it and I just didn't want to break one of the bolts and then have a bigger issue so let me just show you this is part one of the whole process I did buy a, an exchange uh, electric pump which I'm gonna show you in the next video on how to fill up the transmission how to um, cycle it, turn the truck on, and then keep adding fu uh, fluid to it. So I will be doing another video on that. Uh, for now, this video is basically just depicting on the the things you need to do as far as, you know, lubing up these bolts, trying to break them loose with time and heat cycles so you don't have a mess where you break one off in the case of the trans. So let me just show you guys what I've uh, actually done. I used... Uh, regular hammer and a punch you know and i kind of bang the top of the head and the side of that that aluminum spacer you don't know you don't need to go crazy just you know give it a couple bangs and then spray some wd-40 in there and then do it about three times this is the second time i've done it you can see it's got three bolts on each end which is it's pretty cool i mean i'm usually dealing with 700 r4s and 4l60s and 80s and they got about like 16, 18 bolts. This is pretty neat. It's got three bolts on each side. Nothing crazy. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see. Sorry for the video quality. I'm going to get better at that. But um, I did spray the bolts on. So let me show you real quick. So you can see where the oil is dripping out of it. It's a WD-40. So I put the, the actual straw in here on the sides and then just shoot it with some WD-40 and then I usually will hit it with the punch here and here and on top of the head. So do that to all six of them, you know, um, be patient with it. Don't think that you're going to do it in two hours. You might get lucky, you might not, but it's better that you spray them, bang them around a couple of times, drive it around, get it hot. And do it every night, you know, three three times at least. This should come loose. And, uh, you know, you should be able to take it off without any issues. Uh, I do recommend cleaning the bolts, being that they're aluminum. They might, you know, you don't want to put them back in there with crud on them. So stay tuned, guys. I will have another video on dropping the pan and uh, exchanging the filter. I mean, the fluid and the filter. And you'll see that on the upcoming videos. Hit the subscribe button, give it a like, and I'll let you guys know when the next video comes out. Thanks.